Um, guess what time it is, citizens? We got more sparks. We got Kyle Kuzman. We about to get into the tail of the tape. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about these cards. I'm going to tell you everything you want to know about these cards, including how to get to them. They're accessible. That is the thing that we're looking at right here. This is the only thing that makes it worth our time. But at the end of the day, you need to hit that like button. You need to subscribe to the page and hit that bell notification so you can be notified every time we drop a video. Let's go. Jumping right into it, we can see that right here we have Kyle Kuzma, Damian Lillard, a Galaxy Opal Jason Terry, and a Galaxy Opal Doug Christie. Those are the premier players here, but we also have a Clint Capella. Clint Capella just may be one of those guys. I don't think he's listed here, but he should be. Either way, Clint Capella's here. Yeah, definitely. Clint, Clint's right here. Here he is. Let's zoom up. Matter of fact, Let's get right into it. The tail of the tape is waiting for us. Clint Capella is a center power forward, 6'10", 5'7", I mean 7'5", wingspan. Man, look at this boy. But, I mean, come on, I mean, a 69 three-point shot, that's worse than Shaq. That's worse than that goat Shaq. Um, I don't know, but I don't know, bro. Eight, 89 offensive rebound, and I see it. 95 standing dunk. This looks like some trash. That's a big trash. They're giving us big trash out here. Uh, he does have 12 dunk packages. Big default layup package. Um, I'm looking at a bunch of mid, bro. I mean, seeing as how... I mean, come on. We're in the end of May. Nah, this this is not it, 2K. I think that y'all should step these agendas up for these kids a little bit. Just a little bit. We get into Jason Terry. Looks like a 98 three-point shot. That's that's solid. That's solid. The 98 ball handle. That's solid. 98 speed with ball. 98 speed. 98 acceleration. I'm I'm low key Mick loving it. I mean, that, this is looking like if he wasn't undersized at six two, this might be this might be the thing. 95 perimeter defense. Uh, 95 steal. That means with a shoot, you can get that to 99. He can have elite defense out here with a 98 three point shot. 98 ball handle. 98 speed with ball type. That's that's a that's actually overpowered type beat. The only thing that he's missing might be a little bit of finishing. Yeah, I mean, but other than that, it's looking it's looking good from from the just from that standpoint. Just from the number standpoint, it's looking all right. The signature size up is Derrick Rose. Trey Young escape with John Wall moving step back. You know I like to step and escape. I like to escape and step. There's some pro in there that's not looking too good. He has pro two leaner. Jason Terry is actually looking like a pretty good card for for an undersized guard that you can get your hands on in these Galaxy Opal. For a Galaxy Opal undersized guard, Jason Terry is not looking too bad. Let's get to Grayson Allen. Grayson Allen, is he looking okay? He's actually 6'4", point guard, shooting guard, shooting guard, point guard to be exact. 98 three-point shot, I'm seeing 90 ball handle, 92 speed with ball. I'm seeing a 92 acceleration, 92 speed. He's not too strong with 84 strength. The defense is this one step below 89 steel, 94 speed with ball. I mean, 94 perimeter defense, excuse me. The standing duck is low. The, the finishing is low. Grayson Allen is looking like a C tier. Like I say C, I give him a C. If I had to give a grade on bro without looking at the animations, yeah. I mean, he does have Trey Young escape. Kyrie moving step back. I don't really rock with that Kyrie moving step back, but it's okay. Michael Jordan dribble style, uh, pro two leaner. His jumpers on very quick as we can. We're in a very quick era. That's just the era we in. Six dunk packages with default small layup package. Grayson Allen. I, I'm, I mean, I'm seeing a C. Doug Christie is actually a bigger shoot guard. Six six shooting guard. Twenty seven Hall of Fame badges on all these cards that we just looked at. I'm pretty sure. Forty one gold ones. Twenty seven and twenty seven with Grayson Allen. Twenty seven and thirty one with Jason Terry. 27 and 31 with Clint Capella. So 27 Hall of Fame badges on all of these cards that we just looked at. But as far as Doug Christie, he's one of my favorite players from back in the day from the Kings. Uh, 93 point shot is kind of low. 98 ball handle, 93 speed with ball. What does this card do? He's a defender. 97 perimeter defense. Pretty much 97 defense all across the board. 93, 93 athleticism, 97, 90, 95 vertical. Um, I'm not liking this card. I mean, I would have to get this a C minus, maybe a D plus without looking at the animations. That's pretty low. That's that's low there. Kimber Walker escape with Stephen Curry moving step back might be movie. It might be steppy, but I mean, with a 98 ball handle with a shoe, you can get that to what 94. That's that's I guess that's enough 
I think a 92 bar handle was enough to unlock this, the slippery, slithery moves that you need. And depending on what badges you got to put on, bro, it could be all right. Let's look at Damian Lillard, though. Damian Lillard might be the guard that y'all might have fun with. So, I mean, for an undersized 6'2 guard, he does have 40 Hall of Fame badges. He does have 30 gold ones on him. Look at this 99 three-point shot, 99 mid, 99, 99, 99. He has 99 speed and acceleration. Let me see if he has, he has 99. See, they're giving these little guards, they're giving these small guards a lot of, a whole lot, a lot of, you see, do you see this driving dunk at 99, ball handling at 99, speed with ball at 99, speed, acceleration, vertical at 99, 99, stamina. There's a lot of 99 in here. There's 98 defense, 97 perimeter defense, 99 lateral 99 still. If you can throw extra badges on, bro, I mean, you throw that brick wall on him, challenger, chase down artist. I mean, come on. Only thing that's not him great, though, he doesn't upgrade immovable enforcer. So that might be a problem. He get pushed around a little bit, but he does have 99 strength, I believe. 89 strength, excuse me. But I mean, what's going to make or break this card is signature styles, pro two leaner on him. I see Tyree dribble style, Damian Lillard motion, Trey Young escape. Trey Young is safe with Kyrie's moving step back. So, I mean, and he does have 15 dunk packages on him with Damian Lillard layup package. This card is actually, I'm going to get his card at A. Actually, the only thing that's peg leg in this card is the fact that he's only 187 centimeters tall. If he was not 6'2", I mean, for 2K, for 2K standards in IRL, 6'2 is perfect. You're fine. You've made your mark in the league. You've done your things. You do your stuff. You know how to get to the bucket. You know how to get your shot off. You're perfect. But for 2K standards, 2K standards, just 6-2 is kind of, uh, like I always say, if you go to previous videos, you know that Wimby, if anybody comes out with Wimby, if folks come out with, with let's say, Mo Bamba, if you meet any of these bigger, taller players that are quick, they will they will make it from the baseline to the top of the three point line and they can launch and block your shot from there at that three point line if you're small enough. So that's that's maybe the only thing that's holding him back. Let's get to Kyle Kuzma, a six, nine, small forward, power forward with 40 Hall of Fame badges, 32 gold badges. He's sitting on a 95 three point shot. There's a lot of 95. He's pretty much 95 all across the board. They put him at 95 just about everything. So he's, I'm going to call it, I'm going to call it a wash. I'm going to call it a wash. That doesn't look good to me. He, he does have Trey Young escape. He's sitting on James Harden's moving step back. So, um, I don't know. James Harden's moving step back is not, not the glitchiest, but it creates a whole lot of space. You get a whole lot of space. You step back into Narnia with that. Anyway, default swing layup package. He is sitting on 12 dunk packages. Pro 2 leaner. Kyle Kuzma jumper on very quick. I'm not sure what his jumper is hitting for. At this point in the game, a lot of these jumpers are very slow. I want to say that Larry Bird's jumper, Goat Larry Bird, that plays every position, yeah, he's in jumper kind of slow. This Jokic that they just gave us, the Joker, the level 40 Joker that plays point guard, jumper kind of, kind of slow, kind of, eh. I'm still trying to find it. So, I mean, that is what it is at this point. I mean, let's see what the, let's see what the crowd is saying about these spark cards because it's a lot going on, bro. What are the masses saying? Four more point guards. Uh, that's what we, yes, thank you, thank you. Who is this marketed towards? This is marketed, Flocko, Floki, Floki 5000. I'm going to tell you right now, this is marketed, this is definitely marketed towards people who are not spending money on this game. This is definitely who this is marketed towards. The folks that are not spending their money on this game. Definitely. Look, uh, 2K24, the year of the Dame cards. Yeah, Dame got 99s. They put Dame on. Um, It's a lot going on out here. Thanks so much. This game is amazing. There's a lot of sarcasm in here. I swear y'all in love with giving us free point guards, undersized free point guards at that. Man, look. Oh, my wavy called it garbage straight up. I mean, there's a lot going on here. I would like to make my I would like to make my claim right now and say this is the OK drop. It's an OK drop. It's I mean, and, you know, I definitely call it an OK drop because it gives us something to grind. It's just grindable. It's a way to get your MT up. You know, what I mean, let's see what these agendas are hitting for. 
we need to make 104 pointers over multiple clutch time offline or clutch time online games. That'll give you Dame. Win 15 triple threat offline or triple threat online games by six points or more. That'll give you Doug Christie. Make nine three pointers with a 64 three point percentage or higher with a Suns player in a game. With a Maverick player, win five multiplayer games using five Maverick players. Clint Capella high rebounds. Get 26 rebounds in one game for Clint Capella. Get 25 rebounds with the power forwards over multiple salary cap games to get this shoe card. And then 100, score 150 points in the paint over multiple multiplayer games. And then score 41 points and get one block with a Lakers player in a game. And Booyah. You have your spark tool finished. And then you get your uh you get your Kyle Kuzma there. You got your Kyle Kuzma. Yeah. Kobe. Okay. Um that's just that. You got 13 days to go do these. Very easy. Get to it. I mean, you'd also have the challenge. Definitely have spotlight challenges. Spark two spotlight challenge. There are only two objectives here. So, I mean, hey, you're equipped with everything you need to know to get to what you need to get to. We also have some new additions to the team. If you take a look here at this power forward position, we have Larry Legend. We had pulled Larry Legend out the deluxe prize packs, and I got him sitting over here at the power forward spot. He might move to the small forward spot, depending on what I want the team to do sooner than later. But for right now, we sitting here and we working our way towards the new coach, prize coach. I mean, that is that's what it is. We got Jokic out here, and I don't like his jumper. But I do like his leaners. I like the way he's moving in traffic. I like a lot of this. A lot of this stuff is easy. Yeah, he's a little he's a little glitchy. I want to say he's a little glitchy. But this is the new AP flood. And and I I'm loving that. I'm loving that hop. You know, you know me. You know me. I'm I'm trying to perfect that right now. So that's what I'm in the lab trying to perfect. We also have Larry Legend in the building. Larry Legend's jump shot is a little bit sloppy. He is the power forward, small forward Larry. This Larry Bird, tell me that don't look like chalk. That look kind of like chalk. I'm not going to hold you. That look a little bit like chalk. But this Larry right here is the power forward, small forward Larry. He is stacked. 99 three-point shot, uh, 85 driving, standing dunk, 99 driving dunk. I got a shoe on him that got him looking kind of beefy. Um, my coach gave me offensive consistency, but this Larry is stacked, Loki. This Larry is stacked. I got him stacked up with speed, speed with ball acceleration, vertical, all at 99. Uh, I gave him a 99 driving dunk. I wasn't worried about his ball handle too much, but what I am worried about is figuring out how to hit these jumpers because these are this this jump shot is kind of kind of sketchy to me. It's it's a little bit slow. It's just a little bit slow, and I'm getting used to that. I mean, for him to have a 99 jumper, it's just a, a little bit slow, a little bit hard to time. And I mean, yeah, I'm hitting it in here, but we're in a closed arena. There's nobody guarding me. There's no speed ups. There's no slowdowns. There's nobody, uh, nobody in my, my field. You know what I'm saying? So new AP flood. That's just what we on. Let me know in the comment section, what new cards have you gotten out of season seven so far? Are you liking the new Jokic? Did you buy the season pass to get the point guard Jokic? I'm not, I don't, I'm not really too fond of running Joker at point guard. I've been testing it out. I've been trying to see what it feel like to just have him defending the ball. So low key, I've been switching him off to guard the power forward. And I've been having Larry guard my, my point guard. So I'll switch the four with the one basically. Uh, let me know who you got new though. I want to know what you guys are playing with, who you guys are running with and what kind of, uh, what kind of push are you guys getting out of, out of this new season seven so far? I mean, yeah, so high key, I'm just hitting y'all with a little update, letting y'all know what this new, uh, what these new agendas hitting for, you know what I'm saying? You needed to know that. You want to know what the, what the grind is so you can get to that grind. That's that Kyle Kuzma for you. Hopefully you guys are happy grinding. Let me know in the comment section that you liked the video and let me know if you like this style of content. And also we are doing this giveaway. We're doing this giveaway thing. So we get this video to 50 likes and that will push us far enough to where we can give away $50 Xbox card, uh, 2K VC, however you want it. You know what I mean? Any style of delivery is available. You can get to that. Let me know if you are enjoying this content though. Definitely, I need that. 
So I'll see y'all. Happy grinding, bro. Your booze mean nothing. I've seen what makes you cheer.